This is Gene Key, KDD News. Amarillo.com reports a morning fire destroyed a building Wednesday in North Hereford. Firefighters responded to a blaze about 4.15 a.m. at the top of Texas Trucking Company, 3875 U.S. Highway 385. But it had started a long time before firefighters had arrived, according to Fire Marshal Dean Turney. The fire began in an office and spread throughout the 20,000 square foot building. Firefighters were hampered by frozen water lines and slick surfaces while battling the fire. Firefighters declared the blaze under control at 6.30 a.m. Turney said no one was injured in the fire. The cause is still undetermined. Smith County Records list the office value at $400,000. Turney said the building was a total loss. Dumas, as well as many parts of the area, has been affected by the drought and heat of this summer. One of the many issues for local ranchers and cattle lots is lack of local hay to feed the livestock. It looks as though some Panhandle residents were taken advantage of when purchasing hay bales over the internet. The Associated Press reports a Wesson, Mississippi man has been charged with selling hay over the internet. Authorities say the problem is James Darren Hoffman had no hay. Copaw County Chief Investigator Milton Twinner tells the Clarion Ledger that Hoffman was freed on $50,000 bail after his arrest on November 29th. Twinner says Hoffman allegedly had been selling to farmers in Texas through a website called The Hay Barn. The site calls itself a classified ad site for hay, hay equipment, and haying services. Hoffman is charged with four counts of false pretenses. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.